This is an Italian lemon ricotta cake. Moist, delicious, and it will bring joy into your belly. Mm. To make this yummy Italian lemon cake, <laughs> we need 150 grams of ricotta, 150 grams of white sugar, 250 grams of plain flour, one lemon, the most important ingredient, four eggs, top quality please, 50 ml of sunflower oil. Do not use extra virgin in this recipe because it's too rich, too heavy, okay? Use a light oil. 100 ml of milk. I'm using full cream milk, but you can use any milk that you like. Three teaspoons of baking powder and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Simple ingredients to make a fantastic cake. And also get a tin. This is about 10 inches. It can be nine, can be 11, up to you. Doesn't make a big difference. And what you wanna do, you want to put baking paper. Before we make the cake, turn the oven on at 180 degrees Celsius. I am choosing to use fan forced. You can use conventional, it's up to you. You pick the one that we, you prefer. Now, before we get the juice, I like to get the lemon zest from half lemon, it's more than enough. Get the lemon zest because it gives the extra flavors. Now that we have the lemon zest in there, we can add the eggs. First thing to do, we start by beating the eggs, okay? Now, we want to get the juice out of this lemon. Beautiful, beautiful lemon, okay? So we get the juice out, get the juice of one lemon. Now, it's so important that you get the lemon juice because this is the flavor of the cake. So you need to get this. You need to get as much juice as you can, okay? We don't want to serve the cake with pits, okay? That's not good. Oh my God, how many pits do I have in there? Perfect. Now it's time to rock and roll. Come on. As we beat the eggs, we are gonna add the sugar a little bit at a time, okay? Now, now we add the lemon juice. the sunflower oil, we add the milk. Now it's time to add the ricotta. The ricotta is such an important ingredient because it keeps our beautiful cake nice and moist. Gently mix, spread the ricotta everywhere. Now it's time for the teaspoon of vanilla extract. We add a little bit of flour, not too much, just a little bit and mix. Oh, look at that. It's turning into a cream. That's what we want. At this point, we add the baking powder and add more flour, the rest of the flour. And now we mix. Do it gently. Take your time. Get all the flour from the edges. And here we are, guys. The beautiful dough has been done. The cake mix. It's ready. Look, guys, this is the consistency that you want to achieve, okay? If it's not like this, if it's not this runny, you want to add more milk, okay? But you should be able to get this consistency. Okay, now let's put the cake mix in the tin. Oh, beautiful. This baby is now ready to be cooked at 180 degrees Celsius. I'm using the oven fan forced. You can also use conventional, up to you. All I recommend is keep an eye on the top. When you want that to rise and when it becomes golden brown, you are ready to take it out. Okay, so keep an eye. You don't want to burn the top part. So 50 minutes, one hour, that's the time that it can take. Guys, the cake uh, is ready. It's been cooking for 53 minutes, so it's ready. What I do now, I switch off the oven, okay? And I leave the cake in there for about 10, maximum 20 minutes. That way, 
is not gonna go down. You know, it will stay nice, up and strong, okay? Just leave it in there. Ah, oh, look how beautiful this is. Ah, oh, it smells so good. Ladies and gentlemen, the lemon ricotta cake is here, ready for you to be eaten. It's nice and warm, nice and hot. You know what, guys? I can eat it nice and hot. But we're gonna wait a little bit. We're gonna wait until it cools down, okay? I will wait for you. When you take it out of the oven, we need to do the toothpick test. Basically, it's gonna show us if it's cooked inside or not. So what we do is we pick like a plate with a hole, like here. There's a hole there. So I'm gonna put a toothpick in, take it out. And as you can see, it's cooked. What you can see? You can see because there is no runny, there's no cream coming out. If this was still raw inside, this would be wet and creamy, but it's not. So, a cake, it's ready. What I like to do is, I like to cover my cake without foil, so it stays nice and moist while it cools down. I need to cut the cake, it's still warm, and I cannot wait for this cake to get cold. I need to have the cake now. All right, time to unveil this cake. Let's take it out of the tin. Ah, still nice and warm. To be honest, I like it warm. Let's remove baking paper. The sides of the cake are nice. Let's see if the bottom is cooked. Woohoo! Re let's reveal this. You ready, guys? Yeah, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Hello, baby. Oh, fantastic. I love it. Now let's place the cake on a nice plate. Now we're gonna decorate it with some beautiful icing sugar. Yeah, hello. What you can do now, guys, you can have it the way it is. That's how I like it. You can uh, put some raspberries or strawberries on top. You can serve it with ice cream. I like it the way it is, but you do whatever you like. So I like to place some Beautiful raspberries on top. I put it back on the chopping board. I just like it more. Let's cut it and let's reveal this wonderful cake. Oh, it's nice and moist. It's nice and moist. Oh yeah, that's what I wanted. And now guys, are you ready for the big reveal? Are you ready? And here it is. The Italian lemon and ricotta cake. Look at the structure in there. Look, you can see how moist this is. You can see the moisture. Look at the beautiful, moist, sweet bread. Oh, look at that. It came out perfect. Perfection. Look how beautiful it looks. Nice, moist. Let's put it in the plate. Now guys, it's all up to you. You do what you want. You can add chocolate, ice cream, any type of fruit that you want. Anything, honestly. You decorate it the way you want it. And for me, I'm ready to eat. There's nothing else to do. This deserves to be eaten. All right, guys, now it's time to check how moist this is. Ready? Let's cut it with a fork. Yum. Nice and moist. The moment I've been waiting for. Eating time. You ready? Mmm. Mmm. Sweet bread. The lemon is there. The ricotta, it's there, but you can taste it. It helps to make this moist. It helps to give you a better experience. I think I need to have another slice. Oh yeah. See guys, I want you to see. See how moist this is? See, see how soft, how beautiful and moist this is? How soft? This is what we want to achieve, okay? This is what we want to achieve. The milk helps to get this, the ricotta does, and the sunflower oil too, you know? This is what we want to get. And this is what I want in my mouth. 
Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. You know what's nice with this? Some nice mascarpone on top. Or maybe some strawberry coolies. Mmm. Delicious. Delicious. You know what else I like to do with this slice? I like to dunk it in my milk. Mmm. Or maybe hot chocolate. And enjoy it. I love doing that. Mmm. 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 Guys, what can I say? I need to eat. I'm going to eat the whole thing. Oh yeah. Thank you so much for watching this episode. I will see you in the next Vincenzo's Plate video recipe. E ora si mangia. Vincenzo's Plate. Mm-hmm. Yum. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 <laughs> 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 All right, we're ready to start.